On December 5th, 1872, the crew of the British ship called De Gratia spotted a ship off the coast of the Azores. After trying to make contact, they realized something was wrong. The captain of the De Gratia recognized this ship as the Mary Celeste, which was supposed to have reached its destination days earlier. However, it only got weirder after they boarded the ship as they found out all the crew were missing. The Mary Celeste had a crew of 10, including Captain Benjamin Briggs, his wife Sarah, and their two-year-old daughter Sophia, who were nowhere to be found. The strange thing about it is that the Mary Celeste was found in seaworthy condition, with only one lifeboat missing. There was no apparent reason to abandon the ship. All the crew's personal items, including clothing, money, and provisions, were still on board. There was also no sign of a struggle or violence of any kind. The ship could have made it to a number of safe ports in its condition. The last entry on the ship's log was dated November 25, 1872, just nine days before it was discovered floating without its crew. It contained no clues to their fate. There have been a lot of theories put forth, including piracy, icebergs, severe weather, and even UFOs. What could have caused an experienced captain to abandon a seaworthy ship in the middle of an ocean with his own wife and child aboard? What do you think? <laughs>